everybody. Time for a quick look inside Vancouver Public Schools. I'm Nick Bull. One of the coolest traditions of the end of the school year brings high school seniors back to where it all began, elementary school. We stopped by Philida Elementary School today for a grad walk. Se seniors from Columbia River High School, decked out in their caps and gowns, walked up and down the halls, grabbing high fives from younger students. Some of these graduates actually attended Philida, and returning to their old school made them reflect on when they were little. It's weird to think that I was that at one point and now I'm here and at that point I thought college was so far away. Graduating was like just a dream out in nowhere and it's actually, it's like yes you can, you can do this. This is, you'll be here. It's extra special for teachers like Tyann Herbold who saw her old students all grown up. Oh my gosh, it's the best thing about being a teacher is to finally see that they make that final end crossing and they're cap and gown and they look so fabulous. For Philida students, looking up at these new graduates is a glimpse into their own future. I think it would be cool to be in high school because um, I can make lots of new friends. It's inspiring because I know I'm going to be one of them and I know that I'm going to love to go and clap little kindergarten their hands and like be like, you're going to be one too next in a long time. <laughs> this wasn't the only grad walk. Students from every high school visited elementary and middle schools to get kudos on their accomplishment and to encourage younger kids to reach for the finish line. Hey, check this out. It's our favorite social media post of the day. This was posted by Jenny Hansen, a news anchor at Coin Channel 6. Fifth graders from Sacagawea Elementary got a field trip downtown to see how the pros do TV news. At SAC, every fifth grader has the chance to participate in Skyhawk News, the in-house news show produced by teacher Jeff Lee. You can see the great work all those kids do if you just look up Skyhawk News on YouTube. Hey, speaking of YouTube, you can find the school district on there if you're on social media. Why not connect with us? We are on Facebook, Twitter, YouTube, and Instagram. Until next time, I'm Nick Bull.